Hi guys, my name is Jade Naomi and today I'm going to be doing a highly requested video which is my what's in my bag. I've been seeing a bunch of people do it so I wanted to hop on the trend. This is my Juicy Couture bag. It was originally $500 but obviously I didn't have the moolah to spend that. This was 40 bucks on eBay. I got a really good deal for it obviously. It is kind of like a mock Balenciaga bag but it says you see right here I don't know if you can see it sorry it's a black leather the straps are definitely my favorite part I'm gonna show you the charms first which I always keep a bunch of charms on any of my bags kind of like my personal um, touch <laughs> so I have my Justin Bieber charm that's not Justin Bieber oh my god this is the Jonas Brothers and then let me try to show it up close. That's my Jonas Brothers charm. Sorry, I'm gonna keep having to take my camera down and take out the SD card. I have no memory on my camera, so sorry, I have to keep restarting this. But we have the charms on the outside of my bag. This one's a peace sign. This one is a pocket knife that I got at Claire's forever ago. It says Angel on it in cute little font. It's my favorite. It just has little tweezers that I used to cut my eyelashes. Then we have these Kathy Von Zeeland Le Fleur charms. A heart rhinestone little, I don't know what kind of stone that is. And then there's a Juicy Couture heart charm, which I actually added myself and it says Juicy Couture on it. My arm is getting so tired holding up that bag. I'm probably going to get muscles just from holding up this heavy bag. It has so much stuff in it. I wish I could show the Jonas Brothers charm off more. Maybe this is a good shot. Now that we've covered the charms, let's get into the bag. And you can't really see, but on the outside of the bag, there's this little pocket that switches, and you can open it up. And that's where it says Juicy Couture in Old English handwriting, which this camera will not pick it up, but it does. On the inside of that, apparently I have some bracelets that I haven't used in a while. I don't know how they got in there. I've actually been looking for this foiled bracelet. I got it at um, this place called Super Cheap. Is it Super Cheap? I don't know. I filmed a little shop with me there, but that's where I got that. There's also a zipper compartment right here. And it just has a tan tattoo from the last time I went to the tanning salon and got a spray tan. Guida in training, right here. <laughs> I cringe myself out sometimes. Uh, the only thing left in here is an earring that I don't have the match to. It's these black star danglies. I don't have the matching one. And now it's time for the inside of the bag. I'm super excited. The first thing I see whenever I open up my bag is my lanyard. It has all the swirly dirlies you could ever imagine on it. I don't know what this is called. I think it's damask print. All I know is it's very leafy and I like it a lot. And it has my princess little keychain or um, yeah, my princess keychain that my parents got in Myrtle Beach because they like to go on vacation without me. And yeah, that's the first thing in my bag. The next thing that I see on top of my bag is my Playboy wallet, which I found in my second to last Look With Me 7 or 8, the one that's titled Creepazoid Chronicles. Pretty sad, I know. But um, this is what it looks like. It has a lacy detail. I'm pretty sure you've seen it before if you're not new to this channel. But it just has my identification, which is a really cute picture of moi. I don't know, I can't show you the rest of my ID, obviously, so I had to cover it up. There's absolutely no moolah in here. Well, there's a tiny bit of cashola, which I'm working on making it more. <laughs> the next thing is my ice cubes, which these are the, this is the only gum I will ever put in my mouth. It's peppermint. I don't like spearmint. That's a whole other conversation. Spearmint gum's <laughs> disgusting. So... I choose peppermint. It says girls only on here to let the boys know. I would totally give you a piece if you were actually here. 
that you never come over to my hizzy. <laughs> That's the best gum ever. The next thing I have in my purse is this pink gel pen because pretty girls use pink gel pens. I'm trying to get it so you guys can see. Maybe if I put it here, it's like cooler. I don't know. But here is my makeup bag, which I guess we'll go through now. It is black sequins. It's actually a wristlet whenever I go to the club and dance and Jersey Turnpike or whatever. It doesn't, like my stuff won't fall out and I can have it really secure on my wrist. So that's what I usually do whenever I'm out. I just bring this in my bag and just take all my necessities in here. So you should definitely get a wristlet if you're going out dancing. A purse is just, you can't even dance with it. So just get a wristlet if you can. Yeah, I probably should have put my bag like right here from the beginning so you could really see what's in the inside. And what's in my makeup bag is really important. It has all my lip glosses and all my MAC lipsticks, which I would probably fall off the face of this planet. Well, the world's not, or I mean, the world's not flat. The planet's not flat, so I probably couldn't fall off. But I couldn't live on this darn planet without my lip, my lippies. Oops. They're falling out. I have so many. Um, first up is Myth by MAC. I'm not going to show them all, but I'll show this one. It's my favorite, Nudie. Mm -hmm. It's timeless. I will be wearing Myth forever. Up next is Angel and St. Germain. St. Germain's the best pink. Angel is what Kim Kardashian wears. And this is what St. Germain looks like. I can picture it on right now. It looks amazing, balls. I forgot to turn on my music. Hold on. There we go. Up next in my baggie, well, let me throw that out. Up next in my little baggie is The Gloss by Revlon. This is a really good gloss, which I use whenever I don't have my Dior and Princess. Dior and Princess is probably the prettiest gloss on the face of the planet. Again, the whole planet thing. <laughs> but, um, me and my mom really like this gloss. She borrowed it for a while and now I have it. But a lot of people um, know about this now and it's sold out, which kind of pees me out. But I have two Victoria's Secret lip glosses. One is in Candy Baby and the next one's in Vanilla Crystal. Some baby lips, which kind of matches my outfit. This is my favorite flavor, Quenched. It smells divine. Some Viva La Juicy lotion. This is the Gold Couture scent. I like this variant more than the regular Viva La Juicy, which you probably wouldn't know unless I made this video. Oh, apparently there's a Hershey's Kiss. Not a Hershey's Kiss. This isn't Hershey's Kiss. This is just my bag's fallen. This is actually a chocolate bar. The next thing. I have are my zebra tweezers. These are from Dollar Tree. If you want to go pick them up, you can get them at Dollar Tree. This Love VS mirror that my mumsy had in her stuff, and she just never used it. It had the plastic on it for years, so I took it out and started using it. Then there's a Hello Kitty nail file. There's actually two Hello Kitty nail files. This one's regular cheetah, and this one's pink cheater. The girliest deodorant you could ever think of is the last thing in my little bag. It's Teen Spirit. It smells like Nirvana, which, but like Nirvana in the ethereal, amazing way, not in the rocker way, which we love the rocker way, but it smells amazeballs. I love it. This is the best deodorant you could ever have. Alrighty. Now that we're all done with my little black sequin makeup bag, I'm going to go to the rest of my purse. My glasses should be in this little compartment right here, but they've fallen out. I usually scratch up my glasses. I'm like known for that. I used to leave them on the floor of my room and like step on them. Step on them on accident, but these are my favorite pair of sunglasses. These are my pair of <laughs> These are my favorite pair of sunglasses. There's zebra on the sides. I've had them for abs, and I'm probably gonna have them forever and more. 
and I got them at my favorite store in my local mall. This is what they look like up close. After my glasses, we have my favorite perfume, the Paris Hilton Can Can Burlesque. You have to try a sniff of this. It's amazeballs. Some China Glaze Hot Pink Polish for if my toes get all chipped up. The next thing is this Cheetah Hair Clip, which I always keep in my bag for poof necessities. There's two iPhone 4s. I use to film all of my YouTube videos. I'm actually filming this on my digital camera, so hence the quality. These are my favorite though. One zebra, one cheater. Apparently, <laughs> apparently there's a duck nail at the bottom of my purse. That's hot. It's a little crusty in there. I probably should clean it out since I'm doing this video. Sounds like a good idea. There's nothing else in this bag, or little, there's nothing else in this compartment. Ooh, there's some goodies in here. There's some Victoria's Secret Hand Fanny in Lily Jasmine, which I need to get some new one before I get an infection or something. You know how people are nowadays. <laughs> and there is three hair ties in really cute colors pink, yellow, and blue. Kind of matches my fit. And a pink cheetah hair clip that I got at a store called Gabe's, formerly Rugged Warehouse. I used to shop at Rugged Warehouse all the time. Definitely like it better than Gabe's. Rest in peace. And this little thing, another thing that's RIP is my Hello Kitty brush. It just pops out and had a mirror on the inside of this side. And I get, ooh, I get the snarls out of my hair. But we're not doing that now. Oops. Let me try to put it back together. Humpty Dumpty fell on a wall. He couldn't put himself back together again or whatever. That's what I should say. And that's everything in my bag other than this duck nail that's just floating around at the bottom. Thank you so, so much for watching this What's in My Bag. I will definitely do a new one if I get a new purse or switch bags or something. I definitely have enough purses so I wouldn't necessarily need to get a new one, but this is another look of the empty bag. It feels way lighter so I can show it off better. I really like these charms again. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. I will see you on the flip side. Kisses to my bitches. Kiss kiss. Hug hug.